Over the course of the fall, there's been lots of talk about the El Nino setup for the winter to come. But there's a big difference between the setup for a weak one and a strong El Nino. Here is a weak El Nino winter pattern compared to a strong one where you get an abnormal warmth from coast to coast, much of North America. So we are picking up on an interesting pattern going into the middle of November. Our jet streams very split. We have that polar jet stream going across the Arctic and that Pacific jet, jet stream almost getting down to Mexico. So not a lot of action in Western Canada. So we're going to allow some warmth to kind of stagnate there and that northern polar jet stream, that's going to really prevent some of that Arctic air from sinking down into eastern Canada. So for the next week, almost every part of Canada is going to be at or above normal for the duration of the week. So the big question is, if we can lock into this strength of an El Nino pattern, will it carry on through the entire winter?